The NSBA welcomes you to the Popcorn and Entrepreneurship Series presented by EY. The NSBA would also like to thank last year's feature and the sponsor of this year's Walk of Fame, the Brandt Group of Companies. Hey, this is Travis Lowe coming from the red carpet at NSBA's second annual Popcorn and Entrepreneurship Series presented by EY. Today we're he here to watch a documentary film on the local Saskatchewan success story of Vaughn Wyant and the Wyant Group. This is a story of how hard work, perseverance and true salesmanship led to the success of this company. We're going to have a chance to chat with a couple celebrities and VIPs, so stay tuned for this great documentary film. What do you think about this event? It's amazing. The turnout, another sold out crowd and I think we've topped our first p and &E event actually with this one. Absolutely. Why are these types of events so important for the city of Saskatoon and the province of Saskatchewan? Well, they celebrate entrepreneurship and our economy is built on entrepreneurs. So it's absolutely an amazing event and so many inc incredible entrepreneurs in this room tonight. And it's just that um, extra chance to have that celebration with them and tell their stories. How are you guys doing tonight? What do you guys think about this fantastic event? It's awesome. I have two cars I want. <laughs> <laughs> At least, or three. As a customer of Vaughn's for just about 30 years, bought everything with wheels uh, for three decades. What can you say? He runs a fantastic business and that's why he's successful. How does it feel coming back here uh, for the second annual Popcorn Entrepreneurship event after being uh, featured in the inaugural event? Well, we're still honored by being, in, being in, invited to come back. This is a great event last year and I'm sure it'll be a great event this year as well. We had a tremendous response from last year and so it just turned out great for us and so we're really looking forward to the Wyant story. Yes. Why do you guys think it's so important for us to celebrate and tell the stories of success, of local Saskatchewan entrepreneurship and, and their success stories? Why is this so important? Well, there's a lot of success stories here in Saskatchewan. We're just one of them and, and so on. And I think it's important that we celebrate success because we need more investment in Saskatchewan and entrepreneurs take a risk every day. And there's there's just so many good stories to tell. So I think people can be inspired by them. And I know we were when we first started. There's a lot of great stories in the province and by sharing them, we encourage others to try entrepreneurship. Tell us about uh, why you believe these types of events are so important to celebrate the success of local entrepreneurs. Well, anything that celebrates entrepreneurship in Saskatchewan is a fabulous deal. And when you add a uh, little food, a little wine to it, it even makes it better. And when you add popcorn, obviously, it makes it outstanding. So anything that brings business people together to talk about business, talk about life, talk about life in Saskatoon, that's a great occasion. And tonight's obviously a superb event. And, and what makes Saskatchewan so good to be able to build a business like this, um, to be successful here? What makes this province so special? I think it's our people. I'd like to tell you it was our water or our air, but it's the people. What they've known for decades is if they don't work hard themselves, the benefits won't be there. They're committed to entrepreneurship. They're committed to, and they don't call it entrepreneurship, most business people. They call it just, I'm in a business of this, and I own a business of that. And so it's the people who have that can-do attitude. They have been, uh, you know, lived through hard winters and hard times. And now when it's a chance to, like tonight, to celebrate success, they're doing it, and in full color. I'm here with Don Morgan, Deputy Premier of the province of Saskatchewan, and his lovely wife, Sandy. How are you guys doing tonight? Delighted. We're really pleased to be here. An exciting event. Great automobiles, great family business. We're thrilled. We're, go we're going to be watching a documentary film on the success of a, of a local Saskatchewan family. Why do you think that Saskatchewan is such a great place to do business? You know, we do everything we can to make our province business friendly, but a lot of it has to do with the great people that are in our province. Families like the Wyan family, they've got an entrepreneurial bent, but willing to take chances, willing to take risks, willing to build. We're pleased that we've got families like that. What are you hoping or to learn from tonight, or what are you expecting to see in this story tonight? Well, I think the stories of success are important. They're important for the next generations of leaders to see that it's not all that uh, complicated, but it's hard work and it's dedication. But but really, from the, the low list to the high, we, we can be successful if we put our mind to it. So it, it's an exciting time and really happy to be here. What was your experience last year at last year's uh, inaugural event? I loved it. I think it was the kind of event that we need in Saskatoon. But what I like about this year is it's even bigger and better. 
and I think we have more people out who understand the importance of entrepreneurship, so exactly the kind of thing we need. Well, what I liked about last year and what I think carries into this year is that it really brings the business community together, and it, it just it's, the NSBA is so good at fostering the entrepreneurial spirit, and I think they've sure done that tonight, another, another fantastic event. Well, I think it's important to highlight some of the success stories of the family businesses in the province here in Saskatchewan. There's some great stories, and this is just another example, another example of uh, you know a winning formula that they have, and that they uh, they just work hard and do a great job. And we're really proud of them in the community and all the work they do. So we're really happy that we could speak to them today. Saskatoon needs us. I mean, there's a lot of small businesses, large businesses. It's a, it's a great event. Meeting and getting out with people is the most important thing you can do. Contacts give you everything that you need to do your business. And if you don't have the contacts, you won't have a good business. Have you ever bought a car from Vaughn by chance? I have been fortunate to buy more than one. Started out at Ford, Jubilee Ford. And um, whether my fortunes change or other things, I've now advanced to the Mercedes dealership, have had great experiences with every vehicle I've bought from them. Why is uh, celebrating entrepreneurship so important? Well, entrepreneurship really is what the Saskatchewan economy is all about. Uh, you know, all of these individuals who have, you know, grown these companies, the landscape is decorated with the spirit of, of, every, of all the imports and efforts that everyone has put in. And it's a hardworking community, and, and that's what we're all about, and so we want to be behind it. You know, this is a great night to honor two wonderful people and the whole family, the Wyatt family, so that's a great nod to them. They do so much in the community, but a night like this also brings downtown alive, which is what you want to see. I drove down here tonight, you could hear it already, you could feel the vibe. It's great to get back in Saskatoon and make a great uh, a great evening of it. I think it's a reflection of the growth that we've seen in our province and the success and people just want to uh, be here to celebrate those that uh, have had a long legacy of business in Saskatchewan. I'm here on the braid flooring and window fashions uh, uh, red carpet with Mr. Christian Braid. Last year being the inaugural event, we didn't really know what to expect. What was your, uh, what was your, you know, thoughts about last year's event, and what are you hoping to get out of tonight? Well, I think the big thing for Saskatoon is we're such an entrepreneurial group, and it's really important that we celebrate those that have been so successful. And it's a good opportunity for us young, young folk to learn from uh, you know groups like the Wyants and, yeah. and 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 learn from their experience and and uh, and hopefully influence what uh, the city going forward. Why do you think this event has been so successful and why do you think it's so important that we get here for an event like this? Well, I think first of all, to be an entrepreneur is a, is a special breed in, in themselves, him or her, and I think it's the driving force of our economy. I think it's great to celebrate success for the entrepreneurs who've done a lot of things in the community with creating employment and for making a difference in our community. And of course, the, the Y group are just extraordinary in terms of making a difference and supporting a ton of different events and things in Saskatchewan. The big thing is we're celebrating entrepreneurship in Saskatoon itself is an entrepreneurial community and our organization as well it's primarily made up of entrepreneurs owner managed businesses that uh, they, they like to hear the good business story and we certainly like to showcase that and this this evening's all about that I'm here with the Wyant family, uh, Vaughn, Philip, and Michael, and uh, and Vaughn and Melissa. And, and Melissa, Melissa Vaughn, get over here. Vaughn, can you uh, can you tell us who who's all here with you tonight? Uh, I've got the three children that I know of. Uh, they're uh, girlfriends and wives, and my four grandchildren, plus of course my spouse Lori. Did you guys ever think your guys' story, your story, would be told on the silver screen? I don't know that's much of a story. It's more of a story to other people than it is to me. It's just, we just evolved to this. We didn't really have any preconception that we were gonna end up doing what we're doing. Yeah. But, <laughs> but, but here we are. I mean, it's, it's been a good run for us, for sure. And, and what gives you more butterflies in your stomach? Uh, coming out to an event like this or closing your biggest deal? I actually don't get butterflies at all, ever, really. I used to years ago, though, for yeah. sure, yeah. yeah. But I think it's just, you know, you get involved in, you know, with so many employees and with so many customers and uh, with so many manufacturers and all their employees that you just end up doing this kind of as part of your job. So it, it, it's, it's kind of what we do, really. It's, it, for us, it's about building relationships, and that's what drives our business more than anything else. And, and Michael, uh, what do you think's made this company uh, so successful? I mean, besides the point of having a a ginger at the helm. Uh, what, what's made what's made this whole team successful, and, and what makes you guys special? I think it started with 
you know, the way that we treat our people, trust and respect and, you know, how you build a culture. But, you know, I don't think that we ever dreamed that we'd evolve to where we are today and who knows where we're going to go tomorrow. Um, but we're having a lot of fun doing it and that's the important thing, right? So, yeah. So, so Vaughn is known for, for selling vehicles uh, in, in the most uh, mysterious and, and, and different types of places. Philip, do you have any of your favorite stories? Uh, what's your, let's, let's hear your favorite story of the most unusual, the only, un, most unusual circumstance where you saw your dad sell a car. I don't think there is an unusual circumstance. I just expect him to be selling cars all the time. That's his job, so that's what he's great at. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's all from here, you guys. I, I hope you guys really enjoyed the unveiling tonight, and uh, and you guys uh, just enjoy the evening. Thank you. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. Take care, you guys.